my name is Dave Myers. We're down here in Asbury Park. We're going to talk about the blues for this program. And to my left is Danny Gallagher, known as Big Danny. And uh, without further uh, talk, we're going to play a little bit to let you know what's happening down here in Asbury Park. <laughs> Actually, everybody thinks about the blues from Chicago. Out here in Asbury Park, you know, we've been playing the blues for quite some time. Now, where this thing whole started about 15 years ago and my involvement in the blues was a band called the Blackberry Blues Band. And the uh, Blackberry Blues Band, we had some real good players. We had Paul Dicker playing slide guitar. Not Big Danny, but Big Danny's holding his own on that one. And we had a harmonica player called Southside Johnny. And John was playing the blues back then. And uh, Kenny Pontefello, known as Popeye, playing the drums. So before the Asbury Jukes started playing all the rhythm and blues, uh, not rhythm and blues, but uh, sort of the Temptations type and Sam and Dave type material, we did the blues. And people like uh, Muddy Waters and, um, of course, B.B. King, Taj Mahal, we were playing that type of music. So there's a real good roots down here in the blues uh, happening down here in Asbury Park because... So people that are musicians, some really fine guitar players down here. And the, the blues is like the backbone of rock and roll music. Now, uh, Steve Van Zandt, Bruce Springsteen, Southside, David Sanchez, all from this area. Billy Hector right now at the Fairlands is a fine rhythm and blues guitar player. Some real good blues artists in this area. So my involvement has always been to try to promote uh, get-togethers and to play. Right now down here at the Deck House in Asbury Park, we've been doing it. People who are watching this program should know that there's an artistic uh, expression of rhythm and blues alive here in Asbury Park. There's a lot of people out, out there in, in the world that are working real hard to try and make a good life for themselves and it seems like they need to have something to make them feel better on the weekend from all that hard work rather than going out and going to the beach or going to the rides. They gotta, they gotta have something that makes them smile, something, a release for all that frustration. That's all I'd like to say. Oh, he talking. Hi, I'm Big Danny in the Asbury Park Rock and Roll Museum in Asbury Park, New Jersey. You're watching the Underground Cafe 
Please stay tuned. We'll be right back.